One more bite. Welcome to Hooters. I'll be your waiter. <laughs> oh my gosh. You think I'm the hottest Hooters girl here? What? Just kidding, everyone says that. Yeah, I'm actually Hooters girl of the year. Here's my magazine cover. <laughs> oh crap, the dream just ended. I hate when that happens. Hey, it's Lucas. Welcome back to the Chan Chan. So I'm not actually Hooters Girl of the Year. And that'll never happen. According to my second grade teacher, when I told her that was what I wanted to be when I grow up, she told me to pick a realistic job, so I did. And that's why I opened up a foot massage place at the gas station, because that was realistic, according to her. I also do this YouTube channel on the side. I might not be Hooters royalty, but I am going to try every single Hooters wing flavor. Every single one. And you might be thinking, oh, don't they just have hot wings and like mild? No, they have 20 flavors. 20 hooterific flavors for your tongue. They're hooterin'. I don't even know how you come up with that many flavors for wings, but I'm excited to put each and every one into my mouth. I'm only eating Hooters wings today. I'm gonna be rating each of these flavors on a scale. The bad side being, mmm, yeah. And the good side being, okay now, <laughs> yes. If for some reason you aren't aware, Hooters is a restaurant where hot Hooters girls serve you in Hooters girl outfits. And it's just like Hooters, you know? I feel like you guys get the vibe. There's not really a need to explain any further. Got the wings. <laughs> for some reason, I told them it was for my dad's birthday. They didn't even ask why I ordered so many, but I just came up with the story anyway. I don't know why I did it. Apparently these wings are just as good at home as in the store. They even give you heating instructions on the bag. For breakfast, I decided to do the easier option, micro. Wave. Welcome to the Hooters kitchen. <laughs> Breakfast is almost served. But I'm gonna try some other options throughout the video. You know this is what they're actually doing in the Hooters kitchen. Throwing stuff into microwaves. Is this for table 56? Anyway, I'm about to go to the gym, so we're gonna see maybe Hooters wings are the best pre-workout out there. So here's the first batch to try. First off, I just got a plain wing. Ow, it's hot. <laughs> Did part of the styrofoam burn through? Maybe you aren't supposed to cook them in here. <laughs> anyway, so first up, we just have a plain wing. Plain wing. I don't know who would order one without sauce, but you know, we've got to try them all. I swear Hooters wings are just it. Yes, Hooters Jesus. So on the scale I established, these are more on the mmm, yeah. Cause like they're good, but it's not nearing the okay now, yes, part of this the side of things yet. But let's try mild. Mild wing. Classic, ordered around America every two seconds is a fun fact I read on the Hooters website. Not true, but it should be. That is mild. Also, I gotta say, even in the microwave, these are good. I mean, we're starting out with the boring flavors. This is mild. Obviously, it's mmm, yeah, you know, but medium. Medium wing. Okay. Is it gonna move up the scale? Also, I think this is the first flat I'm trying. Are you a flat or drumstick person? Comment below. I'm a definite drumstick boy. I was born that way. It's moving closer to okay now, yes, but it's still very much, mm, yeah, yeah, side of things. They're hot wing. Hot wing. I've never had this. We're getting into territory I haven't explored. How hot do the Hooters girls make the hot wings? Is it hot one Sean Evans status? I doubt it. I highly doubt it. I keep wanting to dip it in ranch because that's my instinct, but I'm holding back to taste the flavors. Oh my God, I actually don't taste anything. Girl, what? Why isn't it hot? What were the Hooters girls doing back there? I know Hooters girls don't cook the food, but I think they should. They shouldn't just have regular cooks back there. They should be Hooters girls. Don't people say that you can tell if something's cooked with love? I can tell this wasn't cooked by a Hooters girl. It was cooked by a man. I'm getting that his name was William. That's what it tastes like. And he doesn't like to be called Will. No nicknames, William. Yeah, I'm just confused because you can't call a wing hot and have it taste like the mild wing. Hooters! Mmm, yeah. Barbecue. Barbecue wang. I feel like this is very sentimental to me. Not the Hooters barbecue wing, but just barbecue wings in general. It's kind of how I got my toe into the water of wing world, you know? I always was eating the barbecue wings. I advanced to the buffaloes and stuff, but that was my first love. Mmm. It's like running into someone you used to talk to in high school. And like, you haven't made eye contact yet, so you hide so you don't have to talk, you know? It's good. It gave something different. It had more flavor. Dare I say it's a okay now, yes. Oh no, my hands are so dirty. Good thing Hooters gives you a finger bowl. Gosh, I swear Hooters girls are always looking out for you. Breakfast of the champions! So before we get into the next batch of wings for lunch, I'm the Cincinnati Hooters general manager, and I wanted to let you guys in on a little bit of behind the scenes. There's a new potential Hooters girl coming in for an interview. See if she has what it takes. 
Hi, I'm here for my Hooters interview. My name is Jacob, and I've always wanted to be a Hooters girl. Oh, is, is it you who's trying out? Oh, yeah. So why do you think you could be a Hooters girl? I have so much charisma, or riz. Wait, did you just say Riz? Isn't that like a Gen Z slang? Yeah, I'm Gen Z. Since you know the Gen Z slang, I'll let you in. Cause we're like really trendy here. For lunch, we're gonna be stepping it up. We're gonna be using the oven recipe. We're gonna be eating good for lunch. <laughs> Look how aesthetic that is. I love a home cooked meal. For non-Americans, it's actually a tradition in America. Every Christmas morning, every family, after they get their Santa presents and go to church, they eat 20 wings at Hooters. Just kidding, in my America, that would be a tradition. <sighs> I can't. And there's no one in the upcoming election who's even for that, or, so I'm not gonna vote. Just kidding. Should obviously vote. I do think they should bring back Hooters Airlines though. Oh my God. It smells like heaven in here. Made from scratch. What? I'll eat the one that fell. Did you mix them all up though? Why does everything go wrong in my life? It's all good. Can you imagine if that's what happened on your shift as a Hooters girl bringing them to Jimmy? This is just Buffalo. It's actually Three Mile Island Buffalo. Three Mile Island Buffalo. Do you know what that means? Does it stand for something? Cheers. You were actually saying you weren't that big of a fan of Hooters wings. So what's your initial impression? No, usually when I get them, I'm just like, ew, the, there's so much like skin and stuff, but this one's good. This one tastes exactly like a drumstick from a banquet TV dinner, doesn't it? It kind of does, a little bit elevated. So they have this thing on their website, become a Hooters girl. Then it was just sad because I was thinking like, there's no positions for men. It's just really hard for straight white men like us. These are, uh, they're getting towards the okay now, yeah, for me. Yeah, I was thinking okay now, yeah, because I used to be like, who knows wings suck, but now I understand the people that go here every day. Garlic parmesan wing. It does worry me a little bit how it has powder on it, but I'm excited. It smells like a pizza. Dive in. Yes. Italian Olive Garden twist. Yeah, I would like fool around with this one more. I feel like there's kind of the okay now, yeah type of energy. Yeah, I don't know if I'm just easy, but I was kind of thinking, oh, okay, yeah, nah. I know, like I did want to bring up my food critic side, but I can't lie, like it's good. Moving on to Samurai Teriyaki. Samurai Teriyaki. My sauce on it is turning into like a jello thing, which is kind of gross. Like that actually oh. looks like someone's slabo, but okay. <laughs> This specific wing is dry though. I don't know if it has to do with this samurai teriyaki or if that's just happening. This is a step down. It just doesn't hit as hard. Mm-hmm. Mm, yeah. It's just not fully giving me the, mm, yeah, yeah, hit it, hit it, hit it. You took the words right out of my mouth. Spicy garlic. Spicy garlic. I wanted a spicy moment. Mmm, it has a, a tiny kick actually. This is honestly the perfect amount of spice. Mm hmm It's still tasty. You aren't like ruining the experience. And I'm kind of happy because this one has the most grease so far. So obviously it's, mm -hmm. it's like really good for you then. Yeah, we get our bang for our buck with that one. I actually can't believe you like flats more. Like I've just always been a drumstick person. Drumsticks gross me out a little bit. I feel like flats is more of like the vegan option. Mmm, I could see that. We're like having a little bit too much fun. Why is everything to the bone? I mean, like, I don't want to eat anything. Okay, now, yes. I just love it, actually. Mm -hmm. Garlic habanero. Mm -hmm. Garlic habanero. So is habanero green or red spice? You know how there's like a difference or something? Is it, um, is it green? I think it might be. What's the matter with you? Bring on the heat. I just don't like that taste. It reminds me of like men in their 40s going on a camping trip. Oh my God. I also realized I don't like wings when they aren't doused in sauce. For some reason, when it's dry, it does kind of go to this weird energy. Yeah. I need it wet. <gasps> but the good thing about wings is even a bad wing is good. I don't really think there's a way to really mess it up. Just mmm, yeah, basically. Next up, dinner. I want to have the rest of them now. But before we get into the rest of the wangs. Okay, I know I just hired that new Hooters girl, but I'm firing her. Don't say I'm the prettiest girl here. Look around. <laughs> Stop it. Do you want a refill on that Diet Coke? <laughs> She's flaunting around the restaurant, thinking she owns the place. I'm the number one Hooters girl at this location, so I'm gonna fire her. I am the prettiest Hooters girl at this location. Hooters girl! Oh, one second. That old lady that is the manager of this place wants to talk to me. It's been great here. I Okay, let me just cut this shit. It has nothing to do with your performance. 
you're just, I just want you out of here. This is my turf and you stepped on my turf and you're trying to take it. So pack your bags, pack your shitty little Payless shoes. <laughs> <Get them out>! <laughs> <laughs> That's how my mom used to talk to me. I swear everywhere I go, everyone's hating because I'm so pretty. Time for dinner. Oh, this has been such a good wing day. To be honest, around like three o'clock, I felt a little bit weak. So maybe you aren't meant to just eat wings. You know, I'm doing it for you guys. Doing it for the Chan Chan. Time to load this up. Another home cooked meal. Ah! Dinner. So I know I fired her, but you can come back to eat dinner with us. Ah. Oh. Whoa. I have to click the oven so many times, so make sure it's really off, you know? <laughs> Don't want a fire to start. <laughs> One more time. <laughs> oh. There we go. That was pretty easy, wasn't it? Uh, uh, Jacob. Okay, so first up we have a jerk. Jerk wine. This is a dry rub wing. The Hooters girl gave us ketchup, so. I know they didn't mean to give it, but they probably just assumed you ordered, I ordered fries or something. Mmm, that tastes good. I'm the type of bitch that like ketchup would go with anything. How can you go wrong? Uh-huh. This one's kind of reminding me of like Thanksgiving. It isn't wowing me. Exactly. It's definitely not going high on the middle. Mmm, yeah. Mm, I'm Texas barbecue! Oh. Texas barbecue. <laughs> Everything's bigger in Texas. 24 on the Lexus. I've never been to a Texas barbecue, but this will transport me there. <laughs> yes. Welcome to Texas. Yeehaw. Isn't Sydney Sweetie from Texas? Doesn't that just make sense? For sure. Yeah, it just tastes like a wing with nothing on it. Pathetic. <laughs> Daytona Beach. <laughs> Daytona Beach is a flavor, I guess. Okay, Daytona. I wanna go there now. It's a little bit spicy. Just a little bit. This is like one of my favorite. Get it, boy, get it. Daytona. Okay, now. Yeah. I'm actually thinking that. General Sows. General Sows. Mmm, yeah. Like it was good, but. Yeah, it's for sure not bad, but it isn't the best. This could be like an ASMR video. Who those waitresses eat with dinner with you? And we'd be like whispering. Next up is Cajun. Cajun. Like Jacob said, a lot of you guys might want to see Hot Hooters Girl ASMR. So, this is that. <laughs> Sorry. I'm gonna bite into my wing now. Oh my god, slay. It's a big slay. Yeah. Okay, that's over. Don't click off. I was kind of distracted by the ASMR, but not that good, Cajun. It's one of those B.O. type wings. Exactly. Okay, tray two. Get it, get it, get it. Chipotle honey. Chipotle honey. Why are people adding honey to everything? I know, I've never really gotten it, but maybe I'll get it after this. <laughs> to me, it is good. To me, it's more weird. This is the worst flavor we've had. Oh my God, I don't hate it that hard, but these sugar ones, like they're good, but I could never get a six count of these. No, because Wait. I'm looking for something more savory. I don't want to Brownie wing. No, it's literally a Sour Patch Kid wing. Well, I feel like this needs its own category since you really hated it, so just F it. F it, yeah. Lemon pepper. Lemon pepper. Ooh. Cupcake has a song called Lemon Pepper. For real? Yeah, I mean, it's good. If it wasn't for the cupcake song, I don't even think I would F with it at all. But that's raising it a little bit. Because like if Cupcake likes it, then mm. why won't we? If it was enough for her to write a song about, then I should be liking it more. But it's still a mmm, yeah. Chesapeake. Chesapeake Wang. I have no idea what this even means. Wait, isn't Chesapeake like a town somewhere? There's Chesapeake Bay Retrievers, I know. I Dog do meat. Know, no, what, what's the flavor? I don't get it. <laughs> Wait, is this the one that has no flavor? Maybe they ran out of Chesapeake. Cause yeah, this is just plain. I need some ketchup for that. One. I don't even know if I'm gonna finish it. I'm dropping it too. Hate it. <laughs> Time for another candy wing, hot honey. It's hot honey. Mm -hmm. I could see me effing with this though. Mm -mm 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 -mm. It's better than Chipotle honey, but like you said, I would never get like a six count of this. It's so stupid. I feel like this flavor is better on a pizza. Hot honey drizzled. I'm okay with it, but I don't want to be friends. It's in the middle somewhere. I have been excited about this next wing. Ghost pepper. Scary ghost pepper wang. <gasps> Sean Mother Effing Evans in the house. Don't touch your eyes. Be careful around your eyes. You're careful with the eyes. Careful around your eyes. Make sure to really clarify that every second. Don't touch your eyes. This better be what I'm expecting. I better be in pain for 20 minutes after eating this crying, milk pouring down my face, going on my tits. Like that better be the outcome or I'm gonna be disappointed. From all the previous ones though, I feel like they don't really bring it, the heat. Famous last words. Mm. First of all, that flavor isn't good. We actually don't like that flavor. Ew! That flavor actually just tastes like dirty feet. 
Usually I like spicy stuff, but one more bite. That, I, oh my God, it got into a cut on my tongue. Stop it. Will you stop it? Okay, that's just dumb. Who's getting that? It's just for a joke or what? It actually hurts. Holy crap, am I watering? <sighs> I'm okay with some spice, but it has to taste good. That taste is gross. You're an asshole for making us try that. Wait, maybe if I eat one of these wings, it'll make me calm down. How long does this last for? I'm actually going to get milk down my tits, like I said. Don't touch your eyes! This actually ruined my whole day. So on hot ones, what level would that be? That wouldn't be the last question, right? That's what's crazy about it, is I feel like that would only be like halfway through. And then you have to have this conversation and like, he always goes so in depth with all these questions. Like he really researches, like that would be stressful. I have a new respect for these celebrities. They have it really hard. Honestly. I'm really glad I got to have this Hooters day with you guys. Thanks for coming along. Don't forget to subscribe. Let's both say our favorites. Oh! The, the cheese crusted. Garlic Parmesan. Mm. Hands down. Let your inner Hooters girl shine. <sighs> Love ya.